Clarissa there. Well, to Egypt now, where the killing of an Italian graduate student has the potential to disrupt close ties between the two countries. Italy has angrily demanded a joint investigation after the Cambridge student's bruised body was found more than a week after he had gone missing. Ian Lee has more from Cairo. It was a gruesome discovery. The body of Italian Giulio Reggeni was found next to a road on the outskirts of Cairo. The prosecutor leading the investigation described to CNN the state of his body. The lower half was naked with bruises covering his entire body. He had swollen hands, wounds to the face and head, as well as cuts to his ears. Now the prosecution has ruled out an accident. This is being treated as a criminal act. Speaking to CNN's Max Foster, the Italian foreign minister said Italy wants their experts to help in the investigation. Obviously, we are, we are very upset for what happened, and we asked our, um, the, the Egyptian government uh, to cooperate with us and to allow the Italian authorities to be involved in the inquiry to understand what happened there. It is not acceptable that if an Italian citizen, uh, his victim, and in such a way, his victim of a tragedy in Cairo, uh, there is no cooperation. So I am confident that the Egyptian authorities will cooperate with us to understand what happened, to establish the truth on what happened. Regeni was a Cambridge student who was in Egypt to work on his PhD. He disappeared in Cairo on January 25th. That's the same day as the anniversary of the 2011 revolution. Now, officials had tightened security not only here in the capital, but around the country on that day. Regeni's body has been taken to the morgue. Italian officials hope to bring it home as soon as possible. Ian Lee, CNN, Cairo. Very sad.